Okay guys, so seeing as we're approaching the end of season 3 guys, rumor has it that if you leave a like on this very video that you're watching right now, so yes guys, all you have to do is go down there and click that thumbs up button, you will actually have an incredible, incredible chance of getting the highest ranked tier skin of season 4 when it actually comes out. So yeah guys, as you know, this season we had the Reaper John Wick skin as the tier 100 max rank skin. If you actually want the max rank skin for season 4, which is next season, if you want incredible luck to try and get him as early as possible, smash the like button on this video, you will have incredible incredible chance i guarantee you guys i'm gonna bless you all with a really good luck so when the next season starts comment on my video and tell me i have liked the video and then basically i will just bless you with luck i guess you will just be ready to get whatever the max skin will be so yeah good luck to everyone when season four does actually officially come out hopefully you guys all manage to get the max tier skin without any more rambling let's get straight into today's video hopefully you guys do enjoy this one yo what's up guys and welcome back to another brand new fortnite battle royale video and yes guys today we'll be taking a look at more things that you guys didn't know about about skins in Fortnite Battle Royale and today we have the very special Reaper skin. We'll be taking a look at seven things that you didn't know about the Reaper slash John Wick in Fortnite Battle Royale. Now guys you may be wondering well why are you doing the Reaper out of any other skin? The tomato head's a new skin. Everyone wanted me to do the tomato head or the tomato head however you would like to say it but basically guys the reason I'm doing the Reaper is because it's a unique skin that not that many people even like know things about. They just use it but many people don't actually know things about this skin and plus it's actually coming up for the end of season 3 literally season 3 ends in just a couple of days just under a week basically and I wanted to celebrate this as this is literally the max rank tier um, skin within the season 3 of Fortnite Battle Royale so I just kind of wanted to celebrate the end of season 3 and kind of before we quickly move on to season 4 we will take a look at this max rank skin and some of you guys will know these some of you guys won't this is primarily for the people who won't know these things and don't have this skin or even people that have this skin but just have no idea or like anything about it so yeah for anyone who's watching that fits those topics this one's for you number one out of the seven things that you guys didn't know about the reaper is it's actually based on john wick yes guys believe it or not he is actually based on john wick now we are starting off quite with a like an obvious one because let's be honest guys as some of us do actually know this and this is pretty obvious some of the new players especially like the beginners the people who have only just picked up the game now they will actually have no idea about the skin or even people that are like really young they won't know who john wick is and basically guys if you guys don't know who john wick is it's basically a pair from a film it's basically like a crime like kind of thriller film and John Wick is basically the main character he's the guy with a suit and like the black yeah basically the black suit and he is like a master assassin kind of like a hitman kind of person I don't really know how to explain it you'll just see some screenshots on the screen right now that's basically who John Wick is he basically fights crime yeah there's really nothing else to say and this is basically who the skin the Reaper is based off of in Fortnite Battle Royale like I said this is obvious to some people and I know a lot of people do call him John Wick but just for the beginner player Players. We're starting off nice and easy with one of these facts. So yeah, now that you guys potentially, if you didn't know about this, you now know that the Reaper is actually the John Wick skin. The second thing that you guys probably missed about the Reaper in Fortnite Battle Royale is that actually he has no back bling. He comes with no back bling, and this is actually very strange because a lot of good skins come with good back blings, but for this one, it's like so superior that it doesn't even need a back bling to look cool. This Reaper skin literally has no back bling, and yeah, it's basically just like John Wick in a black suit, nothing else needed. Personally, I think that epic actually did a good decision on this one because if he had a back bling i don't even know what it would like look like so if you guys have any good suggestions about the john wick back bling or the reaper back bling please comment down below because i have no idea what they would even do for a back bling for him personally i just think he looks cool without any back bling he actually does go well with a lot of other skins back bling such as the raven's iron cage back bling i used to love using that on my john wick skin and yeah i just thought i'd throw that one in there for some of the people that don't have this skin again again like i'm saying for the people who do have this skin this is fairly obvious to you but obviously this video is aimed at the people who are newer to the game that have no like experience or knowledge about much of the skins so with that being said that brings me on to the third thing that you guys didn't know about the john wick skin and this is actually the fact that it's part of the hired gun set now guys listen to this the hired gun set is basically the reaper skin the trusty number two harvesting tool pickaxe and the high octane glider now we'll get into the high octane glider in the next thing that you guys didn't know about but basically it's a glider i'll explain it in a minute but basically guys this is like a very small set it's just the skin a harvesting tool and a glider so you could actually see that there's no back bling like i said in the previous thing that you guys didn't know about him so yeah it's a very like scarce little set without a back bling so potentially that leads me to think that maybe in season four we might potentially see a hired gun set back bling and it may even go well with the reaper skin who knows now for some reason i just don't understand why the trusty number two pickaxe goes well with the reaper i mean just because it's black like the whole scheme of the outfit and the color and stuff but to be honest i really don't understand why john wick would carry around a, like a pickaxe with 
with a pencil. I mean, it's like a masterclass assassin, and this guy's going around with a pencil pickaxe. It just doesn't really make sense to me. I would have thought it's something more like Hitman style, like more of like, I don't know, some fancy technology like pickaxe, a pencil out of all things, which is kind of weird. But yeah, he's actually part of the set. So if you actually have the trusty number two pickaxe, make sure to use it with the skin. And also if you have the high octane glider. Now moving on to the next thing, it's like funny how all these things correlate with the next thing I'm talking about. The high octane glider is another thing that you guys didn't know about the Reaper skin. And basically when you reach tier 100 in the season three battle pass, you will actually see that at the end it says there's a few challenges that you can get for it to claim a reward. Now what this reward is, it's actually the high octane glider, which I just mentioned is part of the hired gun set. Now the high octane glider, you have to do like a bunch of challenges. I'm pretty sure you have to do like five, six or seven challenges. They're fairly easy. And yeah, this is like a secret unlock at tier 100. So a lot of people won't actually know about this, especially if you don't have the battle pass or if you are way behind like tier 100 if you're far off. Now you know that when you actually reach tier 100, you not only get this Reaper skin, you will actually get the chance to unlock the high octane glider, which is part of the Reaper set. So it actually goes really well with the John Wick skin. Yeah, another thing that a lot of people probably didn't know about this skin is it actually comes with this glider at tier 100. Number five of the things that you guys probably did not know about the John Wick Reaper skin in Fortnite is actually the fact that he has a smaller head in comparison to the other skins in Fortnite. As you guys know, there's actually like a little hitbox that a lot of people had a myth and rumor about that if you use like a, a woman rather than a male it will be like less easier to hit them but apparently that's not true it's all the same hitbox but however guys there is an advantage to this reaper john wick skin the fact that he has a smaller head and like a smaller frame you can actually use him to hide pretty easily rather than other skins like for example if you have the tomato head skin you will actually have a big big head like a big red head you can't really hide behind trees that well you can't hide behind small objects whereas if you're like the john wick reaper skin you can literally like crouch behind a box or a tree and since your head is significantly smaller than the tomato head even any other skin because John Wick's head for some reason is smaller than everyone else's skins it kind of does give you an advantage just to hide easier and to find your opponents easier without them finding you so yeah that's a cool little kind of trick and I guess a thing that you guys didn't know about because a lot of people didn't know this even I didn't know myself until a few days ago until someone told me so yeah if you guys are literally planning on like being like a stealthy skin I definitely recommend using the Reaper John Wick skin you can easily hide with it a lot more and it's just an intimidating skin altogether i mean a lot of people do have this skin now even when i see this john wick reaper skin and i'm coming up against someone that has it i am actually kind of intimidated because most people with the skin are actually really good players and unfortunately i'm not a really good player myself which kind of sucks but anyway i'll get there but yeah guys that was another thing that you guys didn't know about so make sure you use this reaper skin if you're trying to hide easier rather than the tomato head skin the sixth thing that you guys didn't know about the reaper is actually he's the first ever tier 100 skin in fortnite battle royale history like as you guys know last season we in the season two season obviously we did have the black knight is to be the final max rank like legendary skin and that was only tier 70 so they actually bumped up an extra 30 tiers for season three so he's now officially the first ever fortnite battle royale battle pass tier 100 skin and we've never really seen that before but hopefully in season 4 we'll have another tier 100 legendary skin and hopefully it will be just as equally as good as this skin and it might even compete with the reaper who knows and finally last but not least we have the seventh thing that you guys didn't know about the john wick reaper skin and this is the fact that it is the first ever non-default skin now what i mean by this is as you guys know i have made a lot of videos like the dark voyager secrets for example the rogue agent secrets and basically whenever you actually like walk past them and zoom in really closely in their face you will actually see that underneath all their helmets and masks and outfits you will see that they have basically default skin underneath such as Jonesy the woman like Ramirez skin and like the Asian guy and it's pretty like basic underneath all of like the accessories that they add to make a skin but John Wick the Reaper he was actually the first ever skin that was not based off of like a default skin underneath which is actually quite cool he has like his own like persona I guess because like we did say in a few couple of facts before that he is the tier 100 skin he's like the prized possession of the battle pass and for him to have his own identity it just does make it 10 times more of an important skin because you'd want to get it you're not like anyone else that has like the default skins but yeah he's literally the first ever official tier 100 legendary skin and also the first ever persona skin that is not a default skin in fortnite battle royale so guys that was seven things that you guys didn't know about the reaper john wick skin in fortnite battle royale hopefully you guys did enjoy this one like I said, it was to celebrate the end of this Season 3 coming up for Season 4. Let me know how hyped you are for Season 4 in the comments down below, guys. Remember to tell me what you think the theme of Season 4 will be. This has been it for the video. If you want some free V-Bucks, make sure to click the first link in the description below. Without further ado, I'll see you all in the next one, and peace.